Long ago and far away, a beautiful woman named Belle befriended a beast who lived in an enchanted castle. Now that castle is alive with activity in preparation for a special event. There is much work to be done. You've arrived just in time. Oh, a guest! How exciting! Please type in your name here. If you've been to the castle before, just click on your name, then click on the rose. Oh, how exciting! Belle will be so glad to see you. Lumiere Cogsworth, this is wonderful. You're sure the Beast doesn't know we're planning a surprise party for him? We have maintained the utmost secrecy. I adore surprise parties. They're so surprising. And so much work. We've got to prepare the ballroom, set the table, create the invitations. Oh, settle down, Cogsworth. You're getting yourself all wound up again. Lumiere is right, Cogsworth. Everything will be fine. Quelle chance! Visitors! Help has arrived! This is perfect! With your help, we'll get ready for the party in no time. And then, once the ball starts, you can be our guest! Well, let's get ticking then. Time is of the essence. Allow us to show you around our <laughs> humble abode. There's fun to be had in every room of the castle. Simply click on the door and in you go. Go ahead and explore the kitchen, the ballroom, the library, and the garden. There are different things to do in every room. But remember to stay away from the west wing. The master must not be disturbed. Belle, the secret passages! Oh, that's right. Be sure to keep your eyes open for secret passages. They'll take you from one room to another. And when you're ready to leave a room, just click on the magic mirror and you'll come back here to the foyer. When you're ready to leave the castle entirely, return here to the foyer and click on the mirror. So, select a room and away we will go. Bonjour, mon ami. We are so happy to see you. We need your expert help on a matter of great mystery. Perhaps I should explain the conundrum. In order to surprise the master, we must enter the West Wing. Unfortunately, he has hidden the key in one of these books. Only Cogsworth doesn't remember which book it's hidden behind. I wrote it down in secret code. Secret even to you! Come closer, and we'll explain how to find the key to the West Wing. I need you to choose questions about the book where the key is hidden. I'll find the answer from the secret codes. Then you can eliminate the books that do not fit the answer. For example, click on the Book of Clues. And I will ask you, is it a blue book? And I will answer. If I say yes, you can rule out all the books that are not blue by clicking on the red stripe on the book covers. If I say no, it is not a blue book, then you can dispose of all the blue books. But guess wisely. Speaking of guesses, you may, if you wish, try to guess which book is the mystery book by clicking on the green stripe. But be careful! If you guess incorrectly, you lose a clue. This is precisely why I advise you to guess wisely. We only have a limited number of questions. You can tell how many clues you have by looking at the roses. If they are red, you can still ask more questions. And at each level, you will need to identify the mystery book to get a section of the key. Once you complete all three levels, we will have the complete key to the West Wing. If you want to change the level, click here. If you want to go back to the foyer, click here. Let's get started then, shall we? Cogsworth, is the character on the book wearing a scarf? Let me see. Yes, it is wearing a scarf. Cogsworth, is the character on the book wearing a scarf? Let me see. Yes, it is wearing a scarf. Hmm, does this character have big ears? Alas, 
Not at all. It does not have big ears. Ah, well. So, you think this is the mystery book, hmm? If so, click on the green stripe again. Let us see, let us see. Ah, uh, no. We have only three questions left. Are you certain about this book? Unfortunately, not. Mon ami, we have but two questions left. The character on the book, does it have big teeth? No, it does not have big teeth. Oui, oui, we have arrived at our final question. Does it have wings? No, there are no wings, apparently. Pull the book back. Uh, excuse me. You must click on a book to make a guess. Pull the book back. Uh, uh, excuse me. You must click on a book to make a guess. Uh, 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 excuse me. You must... Oh dear. Let's try again, shall we? Is this character playing an instrument by any chance? Yes. This character is holding an instrument. Very interesting. <laughs> is the background blue? Alas, no. I'm afraid not. Ah, well. Is the background red? Let us see, let us see. Ah, uh, no. Is the background orange? No, this is not it. Regrettable. We have only three questions left. So, you think this is the mystery book? Hmm? If so, click on the green star. Unfortunately, not. Mon ami, we have but two questions left. So, well done. We are on our way. You have found the first piece of the key. Well done. This level can be tricky. Here we go. Level two. Is the background orange? Unfortunately, not. Ah, well, let us try again, shall we? Is the background green? Unfortunately, not. Is the background yellow? Yes, it is yellow. Excellent work. We have only three questions left. Questions. Click here to turn the page. Does it have wings? Hmm, hmm, you see, uh, yes, this character has wings. Mon ami, we have but two questions left. So, formidable. Two down, one to go. Splendid. You have found the second section of the key. The toughest level by far. You can do it. Level three. Does it have wings? No, there are no wings, apparently. Pull the book back. Are you sure you'd like to pull this book back? It will take a... Questions. Click here to turn the page for the next clue. Is the background blue? Alas, no. I'm afraid not. Mon ami, we have but two questions left. Is the background red? 
Let us see. Let us see. Ah, uh, no. We oui, will. Oui, we have arrived at our final question. Is the background orange? Alas, no. I'm afraid not. Are you certain about... Alas, no. I'm afraid not. Oh, drat. Do not give up. Please, may we try again? Is the background orange? No, this is not it. Regrettably. Ah, well, let us... Is the background green? Most certainly it could not be greener. We have only three questions left. Questions. The character on the book, does it have big teeth? Uh, um, uh, yes, there are teeth. Big ones, too. Mon ami, we have but two questions left. So, you think this is the mystery book, hmm? If so, click the key is ours. Magnificent! You found the key! If you want to start the game again, click here. Otherwise, click on the arrow to go back to the foyer. We still have plenty to do to prepare for the ball. Questions? Read. Select the magic mirror to return to the foyer. If you'd like to return to the game, click on the bookshelf. To the foyer. To the foyer. A bientôt. Farewell. See you soon. Back so soon? Thank you for all your help getting things ready for the surprise party. But there are more rooms to visit. So come, let us go and explore them, shall we? Cogsworth. Oh. Wait, we cannot go to the West Wing, my friend. We, we wouldn't want to disturb the master before the big surprise party. There is so much to do before the dance can begin. We'd better get ticking. Oh, Bell knows dozens of dances. There is nothing to worry about. Well, we know a few dances, but I want this to be special. We need to decorate the ballroom, pick out the right outfits and instruments, and create a special new dance for the big surprise party. Oh, maybe our friend can help. Good idea, Lumiere. Would you help me get the ballroom ready for the surprise party? And when you're done, we can put it all together. Click here to choose my ball gown. Click here to choose the steps for the dance. Click here to prepare the music. When you're all finished, you can click on the doors behind me to start the dance. If you'd like to leave the ballroom, click on the magic mirror. Shall we? There's no time to lose. Click on any musician to hear him play an instrument. Click on a musician again to change his instrument. Each musician can play one of three different instruments. Oh, what talented fellows! Once you've selected instruments for all of the musicians, click on the sheet music. Click on any of them to get started. <laughs> Ooh, the master will be quite pleased with this selection. A lovely melody. It will do very nicely for the party. Thank you. Wonderful music for a ball. I can't wait to hear them play this at the ball. What I mean? I cannot keep my bass still. I have to dance. Lovely selection. Our musicians will remember the instruments you've chosen and get them ready for the ball. That 
music sounds beautiful. Hurry and select my outfit and choose my dance steps, then the ball can begin. Click here to choose my outfit, or here to select the steps for the dance. <laughs> Let's What should we dress you in for the surprise party? Let's see what I've got in my drawers. <laughs> Choose a dress to see the whole outfit. If you like it, click on the picture of Belle to select it and return to the ballroom. I was hoping to get a better look at that dress. Oh, that dress is so... Oh, that certainly is a pretty... Oh, that dress is so... Oh... That, oh, that dress is so beautiful! Oh! Oh, that dress is so beautiful! Belle will look fabulous in this ensemble! I can't wait to see her at the ball! Why, all we need now is to choose the dance steps and then the ball can begin. Click on the dance floor to select the steps for the dance. And now, Mon Ami, help create a dance for the master and Belle. Just choose a tile and place it on the ballroom floor, starting here. To have the master and bell step to the right, place the step tile to the right of the start square. For the master and bell to step to the left, place the step tile to the left of the start square. You get the idea? To have the master twirl bell in a circle, put this tile onto the dance floor. If you would like to have the master dip bell in a romantic fashion, put this tile onto the dance floor. I taught him this move myself. To make them spin in a circle, put this tile onto the dance floor. If you'd like the master and bell to fan out to the side, put this tile onto the dance floor. These moves take two, and these take only one. I'll let you know when you only have a few steps left. This banner will show you all the moves you have added to your dance. That way you can put more than one move on a tile, if you'd like, without losing track of what steps you are taking. If you decide you'd like to start over, just click on that irresistible feather duster to reset the dance floor. When you're finished, click here. What are you waiting for? It's time to make some magic happen on the dance floor. Surely you've taken some ballroom dancing classes, hmm? What a brilliant move! I'm afraid there is not enough time for that move. Try one of these. You have completed the dance. It is. If you are sure you want to start over, click again. Very nice choreography. Off we go to decorate the ballroom and dance in it too. That was wonderful. The Beast has no idea we're planning a surprise party. Maybe we should go back to the foyer to see what else needs to be done. Click on the magic mirror to return to the foyer, or click anywhere else to stay in the ballroom. Click on the magic mirror to go back to the foyer. Prepare the music. Congratulations! That was fantastic! Now it's time to see it all put together. If you'd like to see the dance you have just created, click on the doorway. If you'd like to change the decorations, simply click on them. Your artistic talents are perfect for the job. If you'd like to save your dance, play a new dance, or play an old dance, use the dance card. And of course, to exit, click on the magic mirror. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, let the dance begin! What a wonderful evening you've created. Thank you. If you would like to see your masterpiece again, click on the door. 
Otherwise, click on the dance card to either save your dance or watch a different one. Oh, and to leave, just click on the magic mirror. To leave the dance floor, click on the mirror again. If you would like to stay away to leave the dance floor, click on the back we go. That was wonderful. The beast has no idea we're planning a surprise party. Maybe we should go back to the foyer to see what else needs to be done. Click on the magic mirror to return to the foyer, or click anywhere else to stay in the ballroom. Click on the magic mirror to go back to the foyer. If you'd like to return to the foyer, click on the mirror again. If you'd like to stay, click anywhere else. See you soon! I cannot believe how much you have done! We are almost ready for the party. Just one more room and the party can begin! Bell's writing deck. The, the West Wing. Wait, we cannot go to the West Wing, my friend. We, we wouldn't want to disturb the master before the big surprise party. Mama, Mama! What is it, Chip? We need to get ready for the party. But look who's here! Oh, hello, love. Chip and I were just setting the table for the master's party. We have different settings for tea, dinner and dessert. There's so much to do. Would you be a dear and help us? To see how you would do it, look under the plate cover over there. All you have to do is move the dishes and their contents from the cupboard shelves to the table in the right order. Just click on an item to move it down to the placemat. We'll need four place settings for each course. <laughs> and it gets harder with each course. For tea, you only need five pieces, but for dessert, you need seven. Oh, and try not to break anything, okay? Click on the plate cover to change the course you want to build. Good luck, dear. Click on the timer to begin, or to return to the foyer, click on the magic mirror. Let's go! That is the course you are making now. Are you sure you want to start over? If you're sure, click on the plate cover now. Sakes alive! You've discovered the secret passage to the ballroom. Sandwiches! Goody! Goody! 
Change to a new course, click on the plate cover again. Time to prepare the main course. Start again. That is the course you are making now. Are you sure you want to start over? If you're sure, click on the plate cover now. to prepare the main course. Start again.
The main course is ready. But I want something sweet. Maybe some tea or dessert. To change to a new course, click on the plate cover again. Change to a new course, click on the plate cover again. Start again. Speed demon, you are. Fine work. Lumiere, can you come here, please? Yes. <gasps> oh, what an elegant table. All it needs is atmosphere. Okay, one more course and we're ready for the party. Mama, the main course and dessert are finished. All we need now is tea. That's my specialty. To change to a new course, click on the plate cover again. Dessert, my favorite! Oh, <laughs> yeah. 
Couldn't have done it without you. We're all done! By Jove, we are. I suppose the food is all ready for the party now. If you're sure you want... Gosh, it's kind of dark in here. Mama, is that you? Chip? Oh, I thought it was you. Let's get out of here! Hello there. Welcome back to the ballroom. That was wonderful. The Beast has no idea we're planning a surprise party. Maybe we should go back to the foyer to see what else needs to be done. Click on the magic mirror to return to the foyer, or click anywhere else to stay in the ballroom. Click on the magic mirror to go back to the foyer. If you'd like to return to the foyer, click on the mirror again. If you'd like to stay, click anywhere else. See you soon! Terrific! I knew we'd be able to do it, with your help. All you have to do now is click on the west wing and the party can begin. Welcome to the garden. This is where the beautiful stained glass windows in the castle are created. We can make art, create new windows, or even write party invitations for our friends. Each time you come back here, you'll be able to see the latest artwork you've created. Why don't you join me? If you want to paint a picture, choose a background here. If you'd like to make a stained glass window, choose a design here. Once you've created a stained glass window, click here to light it up. To add pictures to your backgrounds, choose a sticker here. If you'd like to make party invitations, click on the card. To see one of your drawings, click on a color tack. To start a new drawing, click on a white tack. To clear the page, click on the paper holder. If you want to erase what you just did, click on the feather. When you're ready to print, click here. If you want to go back to the foyer, click here. Be as creative as you want. I can hardly wait to see your work. Next. Quite an artist. So much talent.
Why, that's the perfect place for that. Fantastic! That's a wonderful picture. Would you like to go back inside? If so, click again on the mirror. If you'd like to stay out here, click anywhere else. Bye-bye. I'll see you soon. Why, hello again. You really have completed quite a bit for the surprise party, but there's more to finish. There are still more rooms to visit. Oh, boy. Here he comes, Mama. Keep it down, dear. Oh, no. He'll hear you. Shh. Surprise! A surprise party from me? So tell us, were you surprised? I never suspected a thing. Thank you. Just as I said all along, we could pull it off without a hitch. I thought you'd wake up when we were cooking, but Mama said you'd sleep right through it. Oh, now, Chip. <laughs> well, sir, there is a young lady here with a request. May I have the first dance? It would be my pleasure. And believe it or not, they lived happily ever after. Welcome back. The West Wing. The Ball. Cogsworth's Library. Mi the Garden. Cre credits. The Garden Writing Desk. Sign in. Look at everyone that helped make our surprise party a success. Welcome back. Eggs. If you're sure you want to leave, click on the mirror again. If you'd like to stay, just click anywhere else. Egg. Goodbye and thank you for helping us. Hope to see you again soon.